We're gonna be building a $25 tackle box and also a $250 tackle box and putting them head to head and seeing which baits are gonna be catching the most fish today. So we're gonna go ahead and go behind us, pick out the baits, put them in the tackle box, get on the boat, hit the water, and catch some big fish. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, also hit the like button. It really helps out the videos, and if you guys wanna see more content like this, let me know down below. Let's get right into it. All right, so we have two tackle boxes here. This one's gonna be the $25. This one's gonna be the $250. I actually got Flusher behind the camera, I'm sure. What's going on, guys? And he's gonna be using the $250 tackle box today. You got lucky. You either got lucky or you didn't I don't know lucky. if I got lucky. I think we're gonna have to use some. Cause this is like a challenge, <laughs> so I don't know. You know, $250 worth of baits, you're gonna be using some expensive ones, so. <laughs> and I, usually I guess, expensive means big. <laughs> yeah, no, that's true, that's true. So we're gonna start off with the $25 build and then we're gonna cut to him and he's gonna show you guys his little secret bait stash for the $250 tackle box build. And then we're gonna go out on the boat and we're gonna do some fishing. So Fletcher's actually got this beautiful little tackle wall over here with a bunch of different baits. He's got crank baits, he's got soft plastics, he's got hooks, he's got weights, you got just about everything over there, Fletcher. Let's see what you got, dude. <laughs> so the problem is you can spend $25 really quick. Like way too quick. You know what I mean? Like if I get a if I get a hard bait, that's about six bucks, bro. Like how the heck am I gonna have that big of a variety? So when it comes down to it, how many baits do you think we should have? Like, should we have like a number on it? I think lucky number seven. I think that's a- Lucky number seven. All right, so I gotta pick do. seven baits. I don't know if that's possible with 25 bucks. I think you're gonna have to like take fractions of baits. <laughs> like you're gonna have to take like maybe- So like, I'm just gonna open a pack and be like, oh, I'm only allowed to have one? Yeah, I think Literally. that's what you're gonna have to do as far as like the soft plastics okay. goes. Like you gotta take like a third of a bag. That's fine. All right, let's go over to here. Let's see what we got. So, all right, you got some sort of crawls up here. You got some rage swimmers, swim baits. You got some beavers. You got some menaces. You got some rage bugs. I don't even know what those are. Speed, speed, uh, speed crawls? I'm not sure. This is my dad's bait wall, by the way. Oh, this is your dad. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And then you got some like brush hogs. Oh, well, cool. All right. So I think the bait of choice that I'm gonna have to start with. All right. This is what we're gonna do. Since I have to have seven baits, I'm probably gonna split it half and half. Like maybe like two to three hard baits and then the rest to be soft baits but we're gonna do the fractions okay right. yeah yeah all right so we're gonna that grab, makes sense so i'm just gonna start grabbing stuff oh gosh all right we're gonna get the rage bugs right here these are in black and blue by the way if you guys want to check out any of the striking baits discount code will be on the screen link will be down below and check them out on striking.com we're gonna start off with these so these are the rage bugs i'll show you guys however many i'm gonna pull out of this package i'm, I'm not sure yet we're gonna grab those what you think dude a menace can't like go wrong with a menace. This is a menace in blue crawl. So this is like a green I love that color. Dude, this oh, color is. is like a great all around color. Yeah, it is. Like, Especially for clear water, it's just yeah, like money. It's just... I also like pairing that up on the jigs that are Ooh. like green pumpkin, blue Ooh. Spot. It's fire. All right, we'll do that. I think we gotta go with the bubblegum worm, dude. Bubblegum worm has done wonders for me in the past. I've actually caught a nine plus on bubblegum worm. Ooh. All right, we got those. Probably go with some brush hogs, man. I'm gonna go with black and blue too. There you go. Oh, fine and dandy, yeah, right? We'll go with black for a full rainbow effect here. <laughs> what else do we got? Let's see, let's see, let's see. How many baits do I got there? I got four baits. Four baits? Four baits. So let's go with some hard baits. So you got you got some spinner baits here. Dude, you got a lot of weights here. What are these, bro? <laughs> this is all, that's an expensive My dad's box. been niffling out of my bait collection. <laughs> yeah, every once in a while, I might have to niffle out of this. <laughs> you, all you do is niffle every time bro, you that, come that, over that, here. That's like a solid 20 bucks. <laughs> all right. Let's see. I, I definitely think we got to go with like a trap. So like some sort of red eye shad. Oh, dude, what is this one? Oh, that's a sexy looking bait. I believe that's $6 too, which we're gonna calculate this here in a moment. I like that color too. That's a good little natural color. I think the fish just smoked that. We're gonna add that one. And then I do kind of like this popper. I think we should add some sort of top water. Oh right? yeah, for sure. I believe that's between six to eight dollars. The we're, palmer fishing my buddy was throwing top water the other day was catching big. They smoked them. And I haven't filmed a top water video this year. This isn't really a top water video, but we're we'll catch one on the top water. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. I need one more. One more. Swimmers? Should we get some rage swimmers? Or what else What else we got over here? We got these big anaconda worms. I don't know if I want to do that. Should I go with the anaconda or should I go with, I should probably go with the swim bait, shouldn't I? I think so, Makes I think sense. so. Let's go with this natural color. What, what is this? I really like that color though. It's like a green with a blue. 
Blue Spark. What is it called? Is that the KVD one? KVD Magic. Oh, yeah. That yeah, that sauce. color looks saucy. So, you got some green on the top, a little bit of silver on the bottom, blue sparkle, money duel. All right. Is that it? I think so. All right. We're going to rock it. So, now this is where Noah's high school math skills are going to have to come into play here. Let's open up this tackle box. All right, Fletcher. This is going to be the most pitiful looking tackle box you'll ever see. <laughs> you know what I mean? When you're playing with 25 bucks, you really don't have too much room. The tackle right. box counts more than the baits. <laughs> this red eye shad right here is $6. I'll go ahead and put that in there. Then you got this popper. That's going to be 8 bucks. So 6 plus 8, Fletcher, is what? 14 14 So I approximately have 10 $11. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you think. <laughs> okay, so with the soft plastics, I think, I believe this pack of soft plastics is like six dollars, but there's seven baits, which would leave each one at about 85 cents. Yeah. Should we Do you want to just call them a dollar? Yeah, let's just call them a dollar. All right, so we're gonna call each soft plastic a dollar, so we have 11 choice. Ooh, we gotta do hooks and weights too. Yeah. So we gotta save money for that. Well, you wanna do like four hooks, two weights? Let's do that first real quick. So open this bad boy up. All right, so I'll say for the hooks, we're gonna do 25 cents a piece. What do you think about that? I think that's a good good idea. So we're gonna get four hooks. And then with the weights, since they're tungsten, I'd say we end up going with 50 cents a pop, right? I'm just gonna have two weights. Yeah, that, that's, right. that's oh, perfect. That'd be fun. So that's $2 between the hooks and the weights. I'm gonna put these in this bottom corner right here. We're actually, look. We'll put the hooks right there. And then we're gonna drop the weights in there, okay? Boom. Boom. So we got two hard baits, hooks, weights. So that's two dollars. What we say, 14, 16 bucks. We have a total of nine dollars left. So now we gotta choose nine soft plastics out of the five options. Should I go two of each and then do one of one? One of one. Because if I do if I do two of four of them, that's well, they're a dollar a piece, so you get Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah, I, so I could do four, four of the baits, I could pick two of them. One of them, I'm only going to pick one. Okay, yeah. All right. So personally, I'm going to go, I love the Menace, but I'm going to have to do it. I'm only going to go with one Menace. Okay. Okay? So one dollar with the Menace, and we're going to get a little close-up shot, man. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Fun and dandy. I'd eat it. Looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm telling you, it's gonna be the worst looking tackle box. We're just gonna put them right up there. Okay? Just he needs one. a little AC up in there too, a little air conditioning. All right, so that means we're gonna go with two of the rest. So we're gonna go with two of the bubble gum worms. Drop them bad boys in the tackle box. Then we're gonna go two of the rage swimmers. Two rage swimmers. Drop them down. And with the old brush hog, or the game hog. Those are black and blue. Ooh, that one, what is it? Is it a melt? They've been in my car. <laughs> That'll do it. <laughs> I was yeah. about to say, listen, if, I, if I'm paying a dollar a pop, boy, I'm gonna have to get some saucy looking ones. All right, these things are greasy too, boy. Good thing they smell like coffee. At least they got a good smell to them, right? Last but not least, this is probably my favorite soft plastic out of all of them, is the Rage Bug. I wish you had Rage Crawls because I love Rage Crawls, but the Rage Bug will definitely do. Those are black and blue, man. You know why I don't have Rage Crawls now? Why? Because if I had Rage Crawls, I would use them you, all. You would take would just, all of them. I probably would, dude. If you had like 100 <laughs> packs of Rage Crawls, I actually tried to place an order the other day and I realized that I had 155 packs of Rage Crawls in my cart and I was like, that might be a That's why I much. can't find any. Maybe that's why I don't have them. Because they're bought. sold out on the website. <laughs> but yeah, so then we got the two black and blue. And that's it, bro. That's, if there's a $25 tackle box, that's a $25 tackle box, baby. What you think? Whew. What you think? That's the best $25 That's tackle best box. <laughs> Except the tackle box is probably about $50 to sell. Yeah, we didn't really think about that. Yeah. Excluding the actual Excluding box. Excluding the actual box, okay? <laughs> That's fair. Well, there's my tackle box, man. That's, that's what I'm going with today. I do think I might end up catching more fish than you. If you're going to have to find $250 for the baits with seven baits. That's an average of like... Almost fifty dollars a bait. <laughs> yeah, that's oh god. Thirty to fifty bucks a bait, bro. All right, yeah, let, me, let me just hand you this thing. Let's right. let's let's get into these guys. All right. So what's what's your game plan for this two hundred fifty dollar build? <sighs> we're going in. We're going into the the saucy little secret stash of expensive baits that I have here. This one's got. 
pretty much every bait that I own that's $20 plus in it at the current moment. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna catch a fish with this in a pond, but this is a, uh, a 10XD. This thing I think is like 20, 25 bucks. And you have to fish this thing in like 30 feet of water, but we're fishing like a five foot pond, so that should be fun. But, you know, you I know. think you're gonna catch a lot of grass. With a that lot one. of grass? Or just a little, a little <laughs> bit too much grass. Probably but. way more grass than bass. Oh yeah. I'm gonna have to take all these out. Smart idea. Boom. <laughs> He's got his own compartment. Yeah. You, you might need a few tackle boxes for this. Then we have one of my personal favorites as far as like little swim baits go. This is an S waiver. Great bang for your buck. And this puppy runs you about $20. This puppy? Puppy. That puppy? puppy? Man, look at the puppies. Everybody knows what this bait is. The Whopper Plopper. Can't go wrong with that. These are a little pricey, but they get the job done. Also, I, let's call it $20. I think they're like 16 or 18, somewhere in there, but you know, for the sake, for the sake of thing, make, uh, making things easy. There we go, spit it out. We'll call it 20. Um, let's go with a small bait. You know, most crankbaits are like five bucks, but this one is $25. We got a mega bass crankbait. You know, all these things are super expensive. So throw that in there. Did you like have this prep before I got here? I feel like you were already like. <laughs> this is just where all the expense. I told you, it's just a it's a secret bait drawer that's got the expensive ones in it. These are these are the ones I hide from you because every time you come, you just take my lures. So and... you yeah, you did have a lock on this yeah. when I came. You know, <laughs> well, I when we got that. here, Noah asked me if I had a big rat lure, and I said. Well, I did, and <laughs> I was like, where do you think it is? It's we have no idea. <laughs> Last time I used it, it went home with them. <laughs> Moving on to another Mega Bass lure. This is like a funky topwater lure. I've only used this once, but it's like a wake bait with a little propeller. I think this should get the job done today. I, like I said to you, my buddy been has been catching some really nice ones on top water in this pond, so hopefully the trend continues today. Then we got two swim baits. This one is another Mega Bass one, and this one is like 35, 30 ish bucks. And this thing is super good. I've had a lot of luck with that. I don't think we should have much problem with that. And then finally, but not least, this is a homemade swim bait that one of my subscribers made for me and sent to me. And I believe these things are around $100. I could be wrong, but <laughs> I've had quite a few swim baits sent to me from, from you guys. and. I believe this one was 100, so we're gonna throw that one in there as well. And this thing is really cool because it's like laser printed and I just like homemade baits. I think they're all unique and I have yet to catch one on this, so hopefully today changes that. That is a saucy looking box, Fletcher. It's, it's a crazy looking one like, compared to mine. Mine just looks <laughs> pitiful. <laughs> like, this isn't even right. But I might have the advantage, even though mine is literally like 10% <laughs> a tenth of the price. So so what's the goal here, Noah? Let me let me ask you that. Are we trying to catch a fish on every bait in the box? Is that is that what we're going that, for here? That's our goal, yeah. Just one by one? One by one. Knock them out? Yeah. Golly, man. <laughs> I mean, how, how am I supposed to catch a fish with this? Listen, you're the one who picked it. <laughs> you picked it, not me. I, I don't know what you Fair want. enough, fair right. enough. But I will say, I think these are like like you're gonna smoke them on these. Yeah, I okay. think these three, these are almost like, set like up. Especially the crankbait. Like that's the one normal <laughs> bait I feel like you got. And then the wake bait, the top orders I think they'll eat it. I, I haven't top order fished this year. I didn't intend to do this, but this is almost like set up in difficulty trays. Like the it easiest, really is. like medium sized swim baits and then big swim bait and just. That, that's. The best, the best pond fishing lure guys. That's this, probably <laughs> gonna be the death of you today. <laughs> I will say though, like, these swim baits too, they smoke them. Those are good oh, yeah. swim baits. I, I like this. I, I've caught a lot of fish on both of those models too. And then these, you should catch them. I, that's that's where it gets a little iffy. That's a little... Oof. Yeah. But we'll figure it out, right? <laughs> I'll figure it out. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and hop into it, load these tackle boxes in the boat, load the boat in the pond, and see what we're going to get after today. I'm a little worried for Fletcher. What are you doing back there, dude? 
You gained a little bit of weight. You've been in the gym, man. Just store the tackle. Been bench pressing a little bit. Man, this is the new bank fishing setup. <laughs> is that the new? Oh, that's the new backpack. The yeah, baby pack, pack that you've been coming out with. I, yeah. I understand now. It's, you know, Makes sense. You gotta keep yeah. it interesting. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go ahead and load this in the boat. Get out on the pond. See what we can do. I'm hoping we really get on some big ones today. We got to scale with this too. So I'm hoping we can get like. I don't know, Fletcher, you might have an opportunity to catch a really big fish today. I think we both do, I, I, but you... I, especially me. I, you know, I got some big baits. Like, we can talk about how you might not win the challenge today, but you might catch the biggest fish today. That is true. So, let's go ahead and get after it. Hope you guys are enjoying it this far. Hit the like button if you haven't already. You better smash that thing, baby. Let's go ahead and hop into it. Get her a little cleaned up. Yeah, gotta take everything out that's not these incredibly well yeah, We're not allowed to well cheat. <laughs> I told Fletcher, I was like, <laughs> so should I put the packs of baits in here? And he's like, no, nah, we can't really do that because, I mean, I'm only allowed to spend 25 bucks. So if I lose a bait, then, I mean, it's whatever. You're out, you're out of luck. We gotta do what we gotta do. Do you want some uh, bullet weight stoppers? Yeah. I'll give you a courtesy. Here's All right. Twenty-five dollars and twenty-five cents. Okay. Make sure you put that in the title. <laughs> Alrighty, we just got the boat in the water. Got all flat. Where are you running? Oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, the blanker. Come back with the dead battery. Are you ready? Yeah, this flood is like to be a girl, dude. This thing just bounces <laughs> up and down here. Good old brawl strap. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we're gonna hop on the boat. And we're about to get it started. So this pond, I've been to one time with you. Yes. I haven't, I haven't been to this pond more than once. So I don't know what to really expect. I know there's some really big fish in here. I've had friends catch the monster fish. I've probably fished it maybe six or seven times. It has a ton of fish. A lot of them are small, but recently my buddies have been catching some decent ones and you know, a handful of fives and threes and stuff like that. So I'm hoping that's what we're gonna find today. Just, you know, some good, solid, healthy sized bass. I've, Water's looking clear too. It, it is really clear. It's really good. Super clear. Yeah, I like it. And I'm curious to see if we can find some fish on bed oh, today, too, right guys. There. I think there's a bass on bed right there. Bro, he is. I saw that too. <laughs> Wait, that? hold on. Wait a minute. Before we even, this don't count, okay? <laughs> Let me flip this doohickey here. Dude, if that fish bites with the boat right here, I will be so confused. I already got a Texas rig on my rod. Let's just flip her. Flip her on out. Dude, I saw, I saw what you, it wasn't, it didn't look like he was big, but yeah. I did see like a tail or something move. Oh yeah, th there is he is. He? There's two small ones. See him? Oh, oh there's dude, there's a lot. Yeah, there's it's a whole small school. ones. Yeah. <laughs> this worm looks good, too. Oh, dude, my legs are killing me. <laughs> Guys, I've been going to the gym twice a day, once in the morning for cardio and once a night and i went i did some legs last night with bob and we just it was something uh, uh, oh, okay yeah there's definitely gonna be some bass on bed i don't think that that's gonna be like what we do today but then again i think i think we will catch one on bed definitely gonna be some but this watered water visibility super clear that's a bed deep right there. You see that? Look at all these beds, bro. All right, y'all. Well, let's go ahead and get this started. I'm going to dig in my tackle box, figure out what we're going to fish with. I'm actually going to just keep the Texas rig that I have on. I don't think there's a point in cutting it off and retying. Before we get into this, yeah. let's put some stakes on it. All right. I'm thinking, I'm thinking winner uh -huh. gets to keep all the tackle. All right. All the tackle boxes. So whoever wins, we keep all the bait. I get to keep all your baits if I win. That wasn't a very good deal. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll, go, we'll, we'll go with it. If I right. win, I get to keep your rod. I get that KT right. combo. All right, that's fair. I'll give you two rods. I've been trying to get this. Uh, this is a hot commodity. I know. I'll give you two. I'll, I'll give you a spinning rod and a bait caster. If you win, if I win, I get to keep the tackle box. All right, that, sounds, that, fair? that sounds like a good deal. Okay, we're doing it. Stakes on the line and winner, we got to catch a fish on every bait. I don't know how the heck you're going to throw a dang 30 foot crankbait in here, but <laughs> I'll leave it to you to. Oh, that's a carp. Oh. <laughs> there you go, bro. Throw that crank baby. You got a snag? Is that totally count? kidding. No, that does not count. <laughs> that is mean. That is mean. Okay, guys. Let's hop after it. Yeah, I saw like a really big fish. I'm like, dude, that is like a 10-pound bass. And I was like, oh, that's 30-pound carp. Yours looks so 
All right, just put yours next to mine real quick. Yours looks so much more appealing. Like, if they laid these two next to each other and was like, no, which one would you want? I would definitely choose that. But to catch fish, I don't, I, I don't think. <laughs> I think all right, all right, big bass. I think that for sure. But the, listen, you can catch a big bass on anything. All right, guys, we're gonna dig in this. Let's let's figure out what we want to use. I'm gonna go with the soft plastic since I have five soft plastics versus two hard baits. And I think the bait that I'm gonna start off with today is simple and sweet, just the rage bug, black and blue. I don't feel like I can go wrong with it. So we're gonna go ahead and put this on the Texas rig. I'll show you guys exactly how I'm rigging it up. And then once I catch a fish or so on this, I'm gonna switch up. I'll probably switch up after the first fish. I don't know, we'll see. So to rig it up, I kind of hopped right into that. I'm gonna go through the head of the bait all the way until where the hook bends and you're gonna break the hook through and you're gonna push the bait up onto the top of this hook. This is a three eye extra wide gap hook, or actually a four eye extra wide gap. And to make sure that this bait lays perfectly flush, you're gonna wanna lay your bait on the hook and right where the back of this hook is, that's where you're gonna wanna penetrate the bait. So do that right there and boom. Put our little nose hook into the bait so it's weedless. That is a beautiful little setup right there. And we're gonna break this apart so you get the flappers. That's money. What you think, Fletch? Money. I like it. Money, dude. Like All right, it. let's awesome. get after it. What am I gonna get into first? That is the question. You think I should start, start with top water? Honestly, yeah. All right, yeah. we're gonna go ride. We're gonna go ride for it. My buddy was out here fishing uh, like three or four days ago. Said he was smoking them on top water, and the conditions are definitely different, but. Hopefully, there's still one in it. We're gonna throw this mega bass, crazy looking top water. I don't even know what kind of top water to call this. I guess it would fall under the the. I don't know if it's a prop bait or a wake bait. It's a prop wake. It's a prop wake. <laughs> that should be good though. Let's go ahead and grab this rod and get this thing tied up. advantage i will say it's like look at his little look at his little <laughs> tiny things does that count <laughs> oh it counts dude those are the tiniest <laughs> bass i've ever seen if it has fins it counts <laughs> <Whoa. Stop. laughs> that, uh, that one almost almost got me in the face yeah that was that was a close that one was, that was close. dude there's some deer running back there really Oh, that's not a deer. That's a golf cart. <laughs> Dude, I will tell you my imagination saw a little fluffy white tail on that sun gun. Did not look like a golf cart. Yeah, look at that Lamborghini. Oh, it's just a Camry. All right. Not anymore. I don't know. Oh, there's, that's a fish right there. You see him? Underneath the twig towards the end of the tree. Oh, uh, yeah. No, no. That's yeah, not yeah. a bad fish, dude. He don't want to pay you no business, does he? He's actually sitting on bed, ain't he? Well, yeah. yeah, you see him move off. Or you just go, is he yeah, looking yeah. at me? I think he's pulling. The ideal bed fish bait. Oh, yeah, you see him? Yeah, That's a good little bass. Oh, I'm, I'm going to go bad. on his hot spot. Yeah, no, that's, that's cool to see. We well, found our first bed fish, guys. Look at the dangle, bro. Just imagine. Oh. Look. Oh. oh. Did he come up What's to he it? doing? Yeah, look, look. Oh. oh, yeah, he's coming. He's coming. Look, dude. Oh. Look at this. He is triggered. Oh, you <laughs> Dude, he's so close to eating it. I just, I'm missing his bed by literally probably eight inches. Bro, that fish is going full. Oh! I was staring at you. Look at that. <laughs> Top water, baby. Let's go. Hey, that's sweet. First fish. I thought Noah was for sure going to get it. Right, but you ready? I'm going to double up with you, dude. Looks like my buddy wasn't lying. Here, he's pissing. Here you go. What am I? Oh, stop. <laughs> <laughs> That's a male. Looks like it's time to switch baits. I think I know what I'm going to. The Wappa Plappa. But our first fish, not bad. Probably about, eh? You want to say like two pounds? Yeah. Yeah. Two, maybe. High, high one. High one. 
one and three quarter. Get her back in. Thanks, little mama. Uh, you know what's the funniest thing is right when you went, Oh, dude, that fish moved off his bed so fast. I swear he heard you. I swear. I'm gonna let Noah have a shot at that bedding fish while I change baits. Going to the plot. Right on his little spot too. He should pull up on that. He just sees us. Oh, here we go. He didn't like that. Yep, I'm on your. I'm on your spot. Yeah, here goes Fletcher. Here he goes. Go yeah, it. he's on. He's nosing on me. Here he goes. He's about to eat it. Would this be the wrong time to oh. ask to ask you for the scissors right to your left? <laughs> Look at him, dude. Dude, I, I really need those scissors over there, bro. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> bro, I can't believe you didn't eat me right there, bro. He's just nose. He's a little squeaky. Oh, oh. Fletcher, watch this. Oh, He's gonna eat it right here. Watch. Dude. Oh, yeah, I see him. I. Oh, dude, he's chasing it back to the oh. boat. That's not what I wanted, buddy. Oh, he's doing a big circle. Look, look, he's coming out of the blue. Look. He's so mad. Oh <laughs> it's crazy how he went from being so calm to just. How triggered are you going to be when I throw this whopper plopper in there and he just spanks it? He's, I got him brewed up for it, honestly. All right, guys. Let's see what else we can put on to entice this bass because he is being, he's 100% going to eat. It's just he is being a little weird. So we are going to take this rage bug off. We're going to put it back on here in a little bit. And I think what I'm going to do, Fletch, I'm going to put on a, pink worm? Yeah. <laughs> I, that's what I, that's what I, I think thinking. this pink worm is going to irritate him. He's going to see this flop in there and I think it's going to be, wouldn't that be yeah, cool to see though? Just like Switch bang. up the bait and then like just get that immediate reaction strike you're looking for. Yeah. I'll be able to see that a lot better too. Seeing the, the shade. Oh yeah. No, see, see this? I can kind of hit, make that tail move more. Look at him coming up on it. Let's see him. Oh, oh, like for you to pop a bait like that in front of a fish's mouth, like look how <laughs> he's literally sniffing it, bro. There's you... <laughs> oh, he's got it. He's got it. Oh, that's it. Yeah, dude, that was awesome. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like a two pounder. He's not three. Didn't he look a lot bigger in the water right there? I think so. That was the most stubborn bedfish I've seen in a very long time. <laughs> the pink worm did it though. Old bubble gumski. Boom. You got a top water off the list. I got the pink worm off the list. Hey, that was cool. That was probably the most stubborn bedfish I've ever seen. Can you agree with me that that fish looked so much bigger? That in the fish water? looked like it was at least three and a half pounds in the water. Why did he look that big? I have. And he's not even two pounds. He might be two pounds if yeah. we're lucky, but he's he's not over that. Wow. I don't know. Well, buddy, thank you for biting. We had to work on you for a minute. I had to get the old bubblegum magic on you. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do? I don't know what he was doing. He was like biting my hand. <laughs> thank you, baby. Oh. Yeah, that fish looked so much bigger in the water. Look at her go right back on her bed. Look at that. Show that to the camera. Flash. She just went out. Let's see. I got my first fish. You got your first fish. I guess we're going to keep on fishing now. We did find a bed fish, though. When we first got here, yeah, look at her on bed now. Oh, yeah. What if I just knocked out every one of my lures on this one fish? <laughs> Do you think it's possible? <laughs> Not without stubborn he was. Why did she look so big in the water? I don't know. I, I am confused on that because I, if I had to a guess, bro, I would have promised you that was between two and a half and three pounds. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right, let's keep on moving. Let's see what else we can do. Y'all, well, since we got the bubble gum trick worm out of the way, I think that was a good choice because I feel like the other Texas rigs, I could fish more like a Texas rig. This might've been a harder yeah. bait to fish on it. So to use that for the bed fish was pretty cool. And to catch the first, my first fish today on bed was very exciting. So let's see what else we got. I might end up putting uh, that rage bug back on. 
to be honest with y'all. That's what I think we're gonna do. I'm gonna go right back to the rage bug where we started and uh, see if we can knock this puppy out. But the switch in the baits did entice the bite. I really do believe that. I think that fish was bound to eat this either way. For sure. But I do think the bubblegum worm kind of... Definitely <laughs> sped up the process. Yeah, it definitely <laughs> made him a little irritated with it. So that's a bonus. That, one thing that's making me feel confident is that at least I, I'm going to get the first cast on a lot of this stuff. I think there's going to be way more interest in those soft plastics. But, hey, you know... Oh, I saw a little flash in there. Oh, I saw some on the edge of this, too. I mean, I've gotten two bites on top water. That makes me feel good. Surprised we haven't got more bites. Dude, I got way too excited. I, 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 bro, I didn't know what <laughs> was happening right there. I just see you go, Whoo! and I look around, I just see a flash oh. of fish. Dude, that water. was actually really cool. That GoPro shot a bit sweet. Hope you guys saw that. That was freaking crazy. That bad boy came out of nowhere, bro. I, all I did is I did this, this thing. I didn't really like yeah. <laughs> jack him. Jack him good. He came out of nowhere though. Like he, he didn't follow me in from there. He came out like this direction. It was almost like it was one of your followers or something. Yeah. Like he came this way. He probably followed this out, honestly. He could have followed your plopper out and just saw this thing and was like, I'm gonna eat it. We're just on the dud end of the lake. Or they're on that bank. <laughs> yeah, one of the two. I feel like that grass thing is gonna happen for yeah. some reason. It's, it's different. Yeah. Yeah, the lay down's not not the trick right now for some reason. Should be one up in that. Of a gun. I, 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 I was gonna get you. <laughs> I saw that. Hook I thought, <laughs> yeah, I thought I'd just uh, <laughs> scare you for a second there. Fletcher, we got a problem. A I ripped bit. my bait, dude. Oh, boy. I ripped my bait. Dude, that was my first bite in a minute. Did you get two of those? Did you break yeah, two of those? Yeah, I did. So oh, okay. I'm lucky. All right, save Ooh. the other one because you might be having the one. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> to finish the challenge. Listen, I paid a dollar per pop, so <laughs> yeah. we gotta conserve these puppies. Oop. I got him. There it is. That oh. was a dang big one. Did you see how big he was? No. I that see. was about a four pounder. Oh, really? Was, he ate it way off, though, yeah. Dang. Yeah. Really, was it? No, seriously. Yeah. That was a dang. Dude, she was huge. He did you not get an eye on her when she came out? I saw like a, just it, a flash. That was I didn't a, get a good look. Bro, that fish was every bit of four. Like just, just, just feel. Yeah. God, look at this wind. I'm like curious because I was so far off that bank too, man. Yeah, they could be off. Golly, <laughs> dude. <laughs> oh, oh, that's Fletcher, like a, Fletcher. That's like a six Fletcher. pounder. Fletcher, do you have oh a swim my. bait? No, you don't Gosh, have a swim bait. Oh, you have the swim bait. Just do it. Just do it. Just drop it. Just I, drop I'm it. just going to let, let this fish fight, oh dude. If you could somehow. Do you see how big God, that one was that with one him? That was big. That was a really big fish. Dude, all right. I'm going to bring this fish up. We, Me and Ryan did this, dude. Oh, I don't see him anymore. I think, he, I think we lost him. Gosh, that fish was every bit of five or six pounds. Why did this little squirt have to bite? <laughs> Dang, dude. That was a freaking big oh. one. It's crazy how, I guess our prediction was right when we were on the other side. Yeah. It just wasn't it. I mean, we did, that was my first cast on this side of the place. 
Well, rage bug off the list now. I wish I would have caught that big and went. That was a girthy, man. She has some, some cheeks on her. Wow. She did have a fat. Oh, oh yeah, let's go. That's a better one. Stay on, stay on, stay on. He's not hooked that well. Oh, that was a beautiful bite. Gosh, she just nipped it, dude. That's a good one, just came up and gave it a little chef's kiss. <laughs> I mean, okay, he wasn't lying about this side of the pond. <laughs> Knocks off another bait. The one thing I realized about you, you don't have to freaking retie every time. <laughs> <laughs> well, I am going to put on a hard bait. Okay. But I do want to flip the same bait back in there. We just had a, how many bites did we do? Oh, did you get another one? Oh, they loaded. Is that the same bait? Yes. <laughs> I could have put on something else and knocked it out, but I mean. Oh. All and right. Well, they biting, they biting. Wow. Have your day flop around. Look at his gills, dude. Well, Fletch, we got to double up. There we go. This is definitely fatter. That's a good fish that you I got, I know. She's got, look at that belly. Yeah. She's got a little chunk. They were all in the same spot. Yeah. <laughs> of course, we caught all the ones that weren't the big, big ones. <laughs> That's still a good fish, dude. That's sweet. Well, we both knocked off two baits off the list. Now it's time for me to switch up, guys. I'm going to actually go. I know I was saying I'm going to go with a hard bait, but I'm going to go with a little soft bait here just because I feel like there's so many. Oh my God. How can you not? Loaded. Yeah, that swim bait, I think you're going to get a big one on, dude. After seeing that big one follow me up and me losing that yeah. other one, the big ones are in here biting. Question. This is not the S waiver in my in my box. You can here. use it. Can I use this one? Yeah, you can is use it. Is that fair play? That is fair play. All right. Breathe. That color does look a lot better. Yeah, I like the color. Well, guys, I'm going to put on a little uh, black and blue brush hog. That's what we're going with next for our next bait of choice. And then I'm probably going to go with a hard bait after. I'm not sure. We just found a lot of fish in this one corner. So I'm just like. I think there's more in here. Dude, you might. <laughs> I bet you that big one might just might have gone right back in there. You might be able to catch that big one. That's going to be crazy. I backlash my reel somehow. Oh God, dude, <laughs> dude same spot. Oh my gosh. I'm the dude. the <laughs> same challenge, bro. I'm not even kidding. This spot is cracked. Oh, holy golly. You didn't even talk about you tying it on. <laughs> no, I mean, I, I asked you if I could use this one, so I didn't retie. I just picked up the one that was on here, one cast with the with the S waiver is all it took. What is going on? <laughs> Got it out, but she came up and just crushed that thing right away. It hit the surface. I just saw like a dark shadow go across one of those trees that's lit up by the sun and just bam, just sucked it in. She did what one more time? She just bam, sucked it in. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I heard you right. <laughs> Let's get another bait tied on. We are <laughs> one cast and done. You can't beat that. Let's bust this open and get on to our next bait. No, what do you think I should go with? I'm going to let you make the call here. Let me pick. This is knocked out. All right. I feel like you're definitely probably going to save these two for last. Probably. All right. I'd say go with the crank bait. The crank? Up to that. Yeah. All right. We'll go crank. We'll go crank. Something different. You'll definitely smoke one on that. That was like the one bait in the box that, that you felt was like gonna get chomped. Yeah. I don't know, man. The, the swim bait game might be might yeah. be popping today. Remember last time we came out here, all they wanted were big baits. I don't think I've ever thrown a crank foot crank bait on a seven six heavy, but we're going for it. Oh my God. <laughs> I did not break the tackle for this. <laughs> Oh, oh no! Oh gosh! Oh, I want that KTV combo, man. Come on. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Got him. <laughs> Noah's too busy talking on the phone back there while I'm running away with the lead. He ain't got nothing on this. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't sleeping on you. You missed one a second ago, too. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm, what am I, three baits away? I know. Literally. Better watch out, son. There we go. 
Let's go ahead and put her back in. Noah's gonna need to catch some fish fast if he wants a shot. I think there's only one sensible option right now, and that is going to be this bluegill swim bait. The bass really like bluegill this time of year, or I shouldn't say like, they hate them with a passion because they get on their beds and whatnot. So they definitely do not like these guys this time of year, so they definitely eat them. Oh, oh. There it is. <laughs> dude, that feels like a decent one. Oh, yeah, that's a good one, dude. That's, that's one of the better ones. Yeah, right that's a three pounder. Oh. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Bro, on that little isolated lay down right there. He, You know what's funny is he bit it like a little small one, dude. He just went tick, tick. Wow. That's a good three pounder. Yeah, buddy. She got any girth to her? Get your own up oh, yeah. here, girl. She got a little thickness. Yeah. It's a good little fish, eh? She's not spawned out, but, you know, she, she's definitely, she definitely got some size. Yeah, she's a little thick girl. A thick booty girl. <laughs> Can I say that? <laughs> Thicker than a snicker. Dude, that's a nice little fish, though. I'm telling you, it bit it like the smallest little bass, though. It's like a little tick, tick. It wasn't nothing crazy. You know, the big ones, sometimes they one hit it. That one was like tick, tick, tick. But, dude, if there's a healthy fish, that's a healthy fish. Oh, yeah. That's the, how pretty that thing is. The colors are just coming out nice. Thank you, baby. Well, I got three baits off the list. You're on bait number five. I'm on bait number four. So I got some catch. Oh, up. yeah. I forgot I had a two bait lead. Yeah, you got a two bait lead off the yeah. first bait. So I am not casting back in. <laughs> <laughs> That was my biggest regret today. <laughs> yeah, Dude, I had four yeah. fish on that uh, rage bug, bro. I was just, I was thinking in my head because I had that fish that came up and I played with yeah. it. Yeah. Then I lost those two by the dock and then I caught an extra one on it. If I lose today, it was my choices, bro. Guess what I'm going with? The popper. The popper. I'm gonna catch you top water. I think this is my first top water fish of the year too. You got the skizzers? We are finally going to stop fishing the Texas rig for a minute. Just for a moment. We got to go back to it. But yeah, we're going to fish with a, a top water right here. A little plopper or a popper. And see if we can get one to pull on it. I bet you there's another fish on that tree, Fletcher. Gotta be. That's probably where that fish came from. Fry on there uh, next to the stick. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, my goodness! Oh, my goodness! That looks so good, bro. Oh. Some about top water. I just it's been it's been too long, man. You go on that like half of your break of top water, and then you come back, and then you throw a couple casts. It's like, oh, my goodness. And I'm kind of excited about this, guys, because I haven't got to throw a moving bait today, and they have been spanking it. That is a tree, bro. Golly. That is a tree in a hat. Take the Texas rig off when you need it for the. I know. I know. I just told myself that I was going to switch out to one of these. But even these trees, it looks so good. Yeah, I think you got a career as a, a jingle rider, man. <laughs> oh, I had a follower. <laughs> Dude, that's when I need to be playing sport with my Texas rig and to drop it down. And... Oh, oh, God, did you see that? God, that the little Dinkasaurus came out and popped my thing. Will he pop my popper? Oh, he'll pop that popper all right. We got a little rip rat back there. Pop in action. The little pop pop. Commitment issues. I've never seen it. Just hit it with it. Oh, that, that, Dude, that was an all too good. That, that, back there. that was amazing. <laughs> amazing. Can't make it up. And it's Yo. perfect timing because I gotta get my Texas rig back on, boys. Look at that little, little male action. Okay. 
and that's my first top water fish of the year guys how exciting oh, we are tied up, up. Oh. we are tied up fletcher i'm coming back for you pretty fish beautiful markings on these bass too man so guys we're going right back to the texas rig that quick because these lay downs right here look so saucy and i think this is my opportunity i got that swim bait i got the menace and i got the trap so i got three baits left just like you got three so you got another one yeah dude they're following this thing like crazy texas rig menace and we'll see if we can knock her out real quick and take the lead me and fletcher tied on number of baits we caught fish on which is just crazy i thought that they would eat a texas rig or plastic a little better today but i think moving baits honestly been pretty productive i i threw that popper less than anything i've thrown today and i was kind of excited to throw it <laughs> it happened way too quick but i am fine with that i like want to put it back on dude like i'm, I'm not pleased <laughs> with that that like top water what was that Did you? Little whippersnapper eat mine. Dude, he is fighting so good, too. He yeah. was way off the bank. Way off? Yeah. Like, he was out in the middle, dude. He thumped that thing so good. Oh, look at that fish, bro. Oh, that one's it's a fatty. That one's built different. That is a fatty. It's committed to it. I know. Fletcher, I hate to say it, dude. <laughs> but I just took the lead. Yeah, I, the, we got to bite at the exact same time. I like, I heard your rod go up as I set my hook. <laughs> really? And my fish is Oh, man. Well, I'm just about done, dude. I'm, I'm getting there. I think I'm going to switch up to the swim bait now, guys. We got the menace out of the way. I think it is time to retire the Texas rig. And we're going to put a swim bait on for the rest of the day. Or actually, no, no, no. I, I got a swim bait and I also got a uh you got a lipless. I got a lipless so I gotta do don't so don't get ahead of yourself over there, big boy. <laughs> What's that? So don't get ahead of yourself over there, big boy. <laughs> Literally guys, two moving baits and we got the duck. That's all we gotta do. Plus you're still on two swim baits and a big crank. So we got the lead slightly, but we still gotta keep going. I'm just glad to get the little soft plastics out of the way and get to play around here a little bit. Some casting action. Yeah, is it awkward? Yeah. Damn, that pine straw hit the shit out of you. <laughs> uh oh. You got one? Yeah, dude. Oh my that was a cool little bite. I hit off that uh, tree, dude, and he just fell. Tuh, tuh, tuh. I hate to break it to you, Fletcher. You're closing in, dude. But I am, once I get my hands on this puppy, I'm down to one lure, buddy. I out am. of all the swim baits, this is the one I have the most confidence in. I know. I and, was thinking the same thing. And I've had. Oh, <gasps> oh, 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 oh I'm still in it. I'm, I'm still in it. I'm still in it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's what go. <laughs> I'll watch that, dude. I was just looking at your bait when you were talking. Wow. Look at that, dude. Double up again. Hey, give me some. Give me some. Wow. Oh. Tell. 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 Swipe. Tell. <laughs> dude, that was cool. That she crushed. That was the best hit I've got all day, too. That was a cool bite. He, she he ate it good. He yeah. Ate it real good. What am I doing? Am I doing it to myself again? <laughs> yeah, you're fishing. I am. <laughs> All right. It's not. Oh, golly. Golly. God, dude. She about ripped my dang thumb off. I was trying to put you in nicely. I was going to say I'm going to put you back quick because I got to get another lure on my line because Noah's pulling away right now. I got two to go and one absolutely absurd bait. But I think we're going to try this little homemade lure next and see if we can't get that done. Well, y'all, it is the time we have been waiting for. We are down to the last lure that I got to catch 
until I own all of these lures. <laughs> no, but no, sir, dude. Huh? Uh, uh, that was the deal, wasn't it? I, I mean, mean, shoot. I mean, it's cute that you think you're going to win. I mean, listen, I'm a cast away, buddy. What if I just threw my next cast and it was all over? I'll cut that line. One cast away, and this is a pretty looking color. I'll tell you, boys. Look at that sexy dog. Ow. I want to see if I can catch me fish old Roman out here. Got a good bit of wind action. Let's see what we can do. That one lure might have been my downfall. But this is like the hot zone, dude. Like this this little this little choke point. All these yeah. fish are stacked up in here. Literally. I can be in this sucker a mile. Oh, there's one in there. He came off that bed. I yeah. thought it was a fish and then I looked away. <laughs> oh, he's pissed too. That fish is pissed. Dude, you don't punch swim baits? Oh, there's two. There's a male and a female. You don't punch swim baits, dude? I bet you I can get the nastiest dangle in the world over that. <laughs> Bro, if you pull this off, I don't even know what to say. Put me in the hall. There thing. is a male and a female up there. Yeah, I thought I saw two. I see one road off here. See him yeah, right. Looking at it. I think he's off right there. Come on, come on, eat it. Oh my god. You got him. You got him, bro. No, he, he, he ate the top of it. He ate the top of it. He ate the top of it. Oh my gosh. Oh, he, Dude, he, he grabbed it this way. I, I honestly think you can get one of these fish. On the yeah, side. that was nutty. That, dark spot. that was nutty. They're both sitting there. This is you. All you. Oh, he's going to turn back around on it, dude. Oh, he's... Oh, 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 oh. What happened? Did you hook Oh, no, no, no. He just he hit the nose of it. He hit, like, the line. He, like... Like, it, he hit it and you could see the nose go down. All right, I'm just going to watch this. Just going to watch it play out? <laughs> I think you can actually get one of these. Oh, me if too. You're have an opportunity, it's right here. This is impossible. <laughs> I was about to try to sit, like, <laughs> take a piss. I'm like, no, 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 let's go. All right, I'm right on the black stuff. Oh yeah, he's pulling up. You see him right there? Yeah. He's looking at you. Is he on the right side? Yeah, he's, he's about to come up to you right now. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, he's... <gasps> yes! Oh, get out, get out, get out! No! On a tree! <laughs> no. I'm going against you, but oh. dude, that makes me mad. Oh my gosh. That was the perfect wraparound for him to... Oh! Dang, I had one, guys. That is unfortunate. That's... That's not. Wow. Gosh, on the big swim bait. Yeah, right when I saw him wrap around that tree, I was hoping you were going to be able to get him out. Yeah. Oh, that's unfortunate. Dang, that is. That is. You can try one more time. I just. Yeah, I definitely had to leave it alone for a minute. Yeah. Well, he can do it. No way, bro. You got one? Oh, it's my. Freaking good one, too. Good one? Or, oh, I guess oh. it's just a trolling motor. Oh, my God. Dude, I was trolling. I was like, <laughs> I'm not giving up. Dude, we were literally going to a different <laughs> pod because we. <laughs> and the <laughs> challenge is complete. Oh. Does that count? <laughs> Does that count? I think that counts. Right, I think well, that well, counts. That count? Did you touch him? Wow, I did not touch him. Does it count? Maybe? I don't know. Mm, I think we can count it. I think we can count it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what a freaking challenge, dude. This was a day and a half, guys. This was a... We, we had a slow start, and then 
all of a sudden we started smoking them and then it was just a hassle like what what would you say the last like two and a half hours have just been painful. yeah a grind like, to say painful. the least and like fletcher uh he works all the way up to that big swim bait he still had the big swim bait and the big crank i honestly we called that dude we called that at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. You'd make it up about that far, but that's where it was going to get interesting. The thing is, I had one. And yeah, you had one on that freaking big swim bait, and he just happened to come off. But, man, what a video, guys. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button. Check out Fletcher's channel down below. Hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. We had a good time doing this challenge. I don't film many challenges anymore, but if you guys want to see some more like this, let your boy know. We'll make sure to do it. If you guys want to check out some of the Kicking Their Bass combos on the website, kickingtheirbass.com, and I will catch you all in the next episode.